Hey everyone, welcome back to another video. It's your boy Mark Bryce. I'm here with this package right here that I've been wanting to open it for a good two weeks now. This is straight imported from Korea, the MS Grill. For those that are interested in wondering which grill this, this type is, now there are two types of MS grills. There is a B type, which is the B Sport, and then there's the A Sport. This specifically is the A Sport Grill uh, Type A. Now, as I mentioned in my last clip, my last video, I'm not sure what to expect because I did order the A uh, type, but I'm just concerned if this doesn't contain the um, the honey honeycomb grill. Uh, it's the ABS plastic grill part. I'm not sure if it contain it contains it well in the photo. It does show it, but then there's another photo where it doesn't show that ABS black honeycomb grill. So I'm not sure what to expect. Is it a two part package or is it just one? Well, let's find out what it is. Now, for those that do follow my car, I have a Hyundai Sonata 2010 3.3 V6 engine. Now, this grill can go on a four cylinder, it can go on a V6 cylinder. I, right now, I'm currently riding on a Lux Gen Grill. That's short for a luxury generation grill, another Korean uh, aftermarket part. I don't think they make that uh, part anymore. I don't think they make that type of grill. Again, I bought that grill about 10 years ago, back in 2011, 2010. So I'm not sure if they still make it. So with that being said, I'm gonna get this painted. And once I get this painted and installed, I'm gonna take my existing grill and I'm gonna put it up in the market. Probably put it on eBay, probably put it on uh, one of my forums that I follow. Or I'm just gonna put it on my Instagram and whoever wants it I'm gonna put a price on it if you guys want it, take it you know uh, again it's already painted black I'm probably gonna show another clip of it and how it looks currently because there are two small little paint chips on the existing grill uh, but it is already painted it's painted a uh, black gloss um, it's just very small little minor uh, little paint chips but again, if you're interested, I'll put a price on it. I think I'm gonna put it on my Instagram channel. But either way, let's get started with this beautiful box here. I didn't expect it to be this big. m &S. You know it's imported when uh, you see that EMS label on it. I'm gonna be very careful with this because I do not want to scratch the, uh, the grill here. The one that I purchased, this one, the current one, when I purchased it from Korea, for some reason it came white to match my car, but I didn't want it white, I wanted it black. No, no. When I bought this grill, it came black, black gloss, and I didn't want black gloss, I wanted it white, so I got it painted white. The white didn't look good because it wasn't matching the car. So what did I do? Instead of spending more money on getting a painted glass, I just plastic dip it black. And then I had it black, plastic dip black for a good eight years until I finally got it painted this, well, last summer. So that's funny how the whole time it came in black, ended up getting a white, but I really started writing it with a painted black grill. So it went back to the original. Let's see what this is all about. But yeah. I'm over here promoting my old grill because it is a nice grill. It's a plain and simple grill for those. It looks identical to the OEM except it doesn't have the H emblem on it. Okay, I'm not going to be able to read this. It says caution. But that's all it says in the American language, caution. Everything else is Korean. I might just hang this up, put it in the office. Okay. 
Yeah, who knows? I might just replace the old grill, put this grill on, even while it's prime. Oh, that's cool. It even comes with a. It even comes with a uh, emblem here. So I can take it off. I'm not sure you guys are gonna be able to see it because of the light. It comes with its own little badge here, emblem badge. I'm gonna do a close up later, and it also comes with 3M tape. I don't use this 3M tape because I have a different type of 3M tape that's more durable. I'll put the link below. Because for some reason, the emblem that I get, the uh, 3M tape that I get from um, aftermarket parts, they don't stick well. I go with the existing Scotch 3M um, double-sided tape that's very durable and it's waterproof, weatherproof. I'll put the link below. So what I do is, for example, seeing this emblem here, it comes with this 3M tape. I'm gonna peel that off and put mine. Oh yes, it does come with the honeycomb grill. Good thing. So it's very close. I'm purchasing the uh, the grill, the honeycomb. If you guys don't know what I'm talking about, the honeycomb black ABS grill. It's this. Oh, it's already attached to it. Okay. Well, I'll show it either way. And yes, it is primed. I have to get it painted. I'm going to take it to my uh, to my painter uh, either today or tomorrow. And you guys are going to come along with me. All right, here we go, guys. You ready? You guys are the first ones to see it because I haven't seen it yet. Yep, it's primed. All right, not bad, not bad. Oh, that's beautiful. This. Right there. This is beautiful. Can't tell. Just put that on the floor there. You see that? This was, this is what I was worried about. I was worried that I was gonna get the grill, but I wouldn't have anything here. And I was concerned I didn't know what company or what good company to purchase the ABS honeycomb grill. So it's already there. Oh wow. And you know it's legit when it has its own badge and code number there MS original design so you know it's legit all right so i'm gonna do a close-up on this this i'm not sure if i'm either gonna use this or i had purchased a type r see you can have it like that but i don't think i'm gonna do that let me show you guys exactly what i'm gonna use You guys might make fun of me. I don't care. I like doing what I want to do with my car. So seeing that this is an M and S grill, Sport Type A, this is a Road Runs emblem. This is not a Road Runs grill. I like the Road Runs grill. No offense to the company Road Runs. They make nice, beautiful grills. It's just that everyone and their mother on the Hyundai Sonata 3.3. Uh, excuse me, a Hyundai Sonata NF, these models, the 2006 and 2010, everyone and their mother is driving a Road Runs aftermarket grill. I like it. I'm glad I didn't buy it because everyone that I go to a car, when we see car meetups or I see photos, they're all driving that same, they have that same style grill. This one looks identical to uh, some that I see, but I'm gonna make it different. I'm using the Road Runs emblem and I'm gonna put it right here. So I'm not gonna open this yet. If you guys can't see it because of the glare, that's fine. I'm gonna get this painted white to match my car. And I'm gonna have this installed right there. It's gonna look cool, it's gonna look different. I know I'm gonna get bashed on the comments. I really don't care. It's just my style, I wanna make it look different so I mix things around. That's what I do with this car. I like it. And so in my previous clip, I'm gonna leave it off at this. I was talking about, um, I'm gonna work on my headlights, the V3s. The B2s that I have right now, I'm gonna take nice photos of them and I'm gonna put them on my Instagram. Follow me on uh, number NYC on Instagram because you're gonna see these B2s that I used to have on my car. I'm gonna sell them for cheap. 
Uh, just because I don't need them, I'm working on V3s now. So the V3s are going to be installed probably, I want to say by March. With that being said, I also have something else in mind. In the works, I'm going to get red leather seats from the Hyundai Genesis 2009 to the 2011 or 12 model. It's the R spec red leather coupe seats. I'm working on with a, with a seller. I'm going to see him soon to see if we can work a deal because the drawback on his seats is in order for me to get the seats at a certain price, I also have to purchase his back red leather seats, including the red door uh, frames. Not the actual door, but the inside that has that red leather. The inside, I can't remember what, the window mount, car mount, I don't know. So he wants me to purchase at a certain amount. I'm not going to give out the price because I have not negotiated anything yet. But for a good amount of money, he wants me, uh, he'll sell me the both red seats, the back red seats, and the doors, the interior door pa door panels, there you go, the interior door panels. All that for a certain amount of money. I don't want to pay that certain amount of money just because I feel it's a little too pricey. I'm going to see him in person in the next couple of days, see if we can negotiate a price. I only want the front seats. And that being said, I'm going to post a video of me getting the red seats, but I won't install them yet. I won't install them until probably, I want to say April, or maybe earlier, depending on how enticed I am when I see them laying around my garage. Either way, guys, I hope you guys found this video cool. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I hope you guys enjoyed this grill. I'm going to put the link below where you can buy this. I don't think they have many left. And yeah. Alright guys, it's your boy Mark Bryce. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please hit that like. If you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. And I'll, guys, I'll catch you guys in the next one. Alright. Let's get inside. We are going to the painter. This is it. We're here. This is a Top Gun Auto Paint. Ooh, I think they're closed. Be back in 10 minutes. Okay. Be back in 10 minutes. Okay. Trying to make a surprise visit, and I ended up getting surprised. Hundred bucks. How long will it take you to Okay. Um, I know. Maybe I'll spray it tomorrow. Oh, nice. I will love it. I'll give you a call. Otherwise, okay. it would be Monday for sure. Oh, okay. Cool. Cool. All right, yeah. Do you guys? I, I might be able to get done. Yes, please do. I'll come pick it up the same day if you want me to. Okay. Yeah. All right. All right. Thank I'll you. I'll give you a yell.